Chaos fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and we are here today doing the generic brand galaxy scenario uh, in Alpha 10. We started on the, uh, the alien planet, and we are now made our way to another arid planet. We are mining Sathium. So I did find... Uh, a couple of nodes that I mined up and I've got a full load right now that we're heading back but what I want to do I got the lights off because the volley I couldn't see drones in the distance because the fog that the volumetric light creates um, so I actually could see better with the lights off uh, I'm I'm not a huge fan of the volumetric lighting right now until they get that adjusted or make it so that we can turn that off. It's it's a real pain in the ass at night. It's just, I, I hate the volumetric lighting. It sucks. Um, you know what? I think we're really close to level 20 though. We're really full too. We, oh yeah, we're super close. Okay, let's just go kill something before we leave right now there's nothing around <laughs> everything everywhere um, lots of golems I've been killing golems and drones to get to the deposits so I did reveal a bunch there's also a very 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 nice I went all the way down. Where is it? That's not it. Yeah, you can see I traveled quite the distance. Ah, these two. This one right here is a fully loaded. Has a whole bunch of thrusters, a couple of turrets. Um, yeah, I mean, if we really wanted to cash in, we could go grab that. Okay, so, <laughs> crazy. I guess if we... I know, there's a... Over at that iron over there, there's a, a drone. We'll go kill it. I think I left it alone because I didn't feel like killing a drone for iron that I didn't need right now. Are you iron? I know you're around here somewhere. Come on, iron. There you are. Okay. And then... Okay, so let's... Let's take a look. See, if we go like this... I can't see squat. Go like this. Let's turn that off. Maybe we can see the drone. No, it's not there. Am I at the wrong one? No. I swear to God, there was... Maybe was it at the Neo? Let's go see. Let's go see. Yeah, there it is. At the Neo. Okay. I knew there was one over here. I didn't really need the Neo. So let's kill this guy. Oh. Come on, there we go. Yay, level 20. There's a spider there too. We could have shot and will. <laughs> Why not? Yay, fun. Okay, we don't need any of that crap. We are full right now anyway. I just wanted to level up. Okay, let's head back. We'll unload and try and lift off the the CV is going to be under heavy load here. The mats container is full. Uh, blocks isn't full, but it overall there's a lot of weight in the vehicle.
Okay. Where are we here? Right over here. So we hit level 20. That means we can upgrade a bunch of stuff. We can do a bunch of stuff. I want to make a um, drill turret for this thing. I want to upgrade the drills on the HV um, because we got enough sathium now. Here, let's dump that off. Uh, mats is too full. We can't put it in the mats. We've got 680. Where did we put that now? Was it output? No, output. We've got a lot of space in output still. Okay. And a, decent, and a lot in, in, well, see, it's the weight that's going to kill us because we have to fly. It's not so much the storage units. We've got a lot of storage units. Uh, lots of stone. Yeah, lots of stone right now. I don't need any more stone. Okay, so let's start dumping it into here. And that's all. I'd rather not put that stuff we can put into mats, I guess. Actually, let's just move this stuff into there too now that we're in this menu and then we'll go into mats uh, was there I don't have anything to put into mats here let's just put it in output for right now and mats will go into where is it no it's here and we'll put that in output. Okay. Okay, so we've unloaded. We have quite a bit of sathium now. Okay, the, my thrusters are really loud. Let me let me park instead of fiddling around and doing this. Oh, I should actually, there's stuff in the fridge here. Let's move that over really quick. Don't want unnecessary spoilage. The fridge is getting full. Why is it full? Oh, because of the plant protein, the stone, some water. Stone and water take up a lot of space. Okay. Um... So, I guess now we're level 20, right? Should we just go to space and... I mean, level 20, we, we, we should make our stuff. So let's, let's see that. We're going to go back out to space where it's a little safer. Let's see if we can take off. Yep, we're taking off. Yay! Can't remember if the gra I think the gravity was pretty low on this planet too, thank God. Okay. We now have the resources to pretty much do what we want in the way of building a base and upgrading this vehicle. Um, I think what we want to do then is find a, a sector to build a base. I, I want to do it fairly close to the sun. So I'm not going to use the starter planet. We've got Namak is pretty close to the sun. Aqua is pretty close to the sun too. I think I want to make my way over to Aqua, if we can get there. Um, what's this got? Silicone, this is a barren planet. 
copper promethium. That's got iron. Let's make our way here. Hopefully it'll connect up. I can't remember if it does, so yeah. That's okay, we've got quite a bit of Pentaxi. So we should be able to do this. Where are you? Did I lock target? Come on. Yeah, let's unlock target, okay. And where's my marker? Where's my marker for it? <sighs> oh, you know what? I got them turned off. That's what I got. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. There we go. Okay. So here we go. Let's go. We'll see what this can connect us to. Doing a little bit of... Uh, universe sector exploring this episode i think that's okay that's a cool looking planet that's very cool what is that guino okay guino planet info there we go it's barren okay Ooh, here we go. Nitrome. Look at, we can get to this one. That's a lava planet, a small lava planet. And we may be able to connect up there. Let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. Nitrome. Do we have enough pentaxid on us? No. Okay, so let's, oops, come on. It's, ugh, if we're moving it, I can't keep the window open. It closes on me. Okay. Uh, tax it, right? So we need devices, advanced constructor. We'll just put it into here for now. Thirty, sixty. I will do eight. That's fine. Okay. That should be enough to do our warp that we need right now. Let's go into here. Output. And then, nope. That's not it. Taxid. There we go. Okay. Get up to 50. There we go. Okay, another lava planet. This one actually has a moon somewhere. There it is in behind. It's over there. All right, there. Okay. Um, oh, it's a cool looking moon, too. Like a lava moon. So we've got, no, oh, we've got Rontat, which is, I'm not sure. And then, so from Nitro, we can get to Balavan, which is a swamp planet. That's cool. Or Rontat, which is another lava planet. Jeez, and that one really has a tight orbit, doesn't it? How do we get to Aqua, though? Do we get to it from Balavan? These planets are much closer, though, but I, I want a planet that I can have some water on it. <laughs> Okay, let's. Okay, this this one's short enough. Let's go, let's try it. it. Has Ascosium and Sapium in orbit. That's nice. Ron Tat right there. And fifty. And. 
Come on. Thank you. Well. Nothing trying to kill us right away. Sassium, uh, Sathium and Zascosium in orbit. And, oh, look at this. We can get to Aqua. Nice. Perfect. Okay, so let's do that. Uh, yeah. Okay, that worked out. Okay, normally I'd probably choose a closer, a planet closer to the, I'll look at the other planet there. There's two planets in this sector. One's not a moon, the other, it's two planets. Uh, it's just getting eclipsed by the other one there because of the distance. Okay, um, I think what we want to do is let's head towards the sun. Head towards the sun. And... We want to put about 10k between, for, uh, we want to be about 10k out from the planet, head towards the sun. And okay, so we should be fairly safe to build right here. Uh, what is in orbit? Promethium and gold. Promethium. Okay, that's good. And let's take a look at what the planets themselves have. So Aqua has Arestium. Arrestrium and Sathium, because it's an ocean planet. That's cool. Water, atmosphere, that might be actually fun to build a base down there. And then we have... What's the other one here? This is Chrome, which is a barren planet. With the restroom, Zascosium, copper, cobalt, silicon, promethium, gold. So that means between the two of them, copper, silicon, iron, copper, silicon, iron, sathium, arrestrium, Zascosium, promethium. So there's no... Is there magnesium? No. So there's no magnesium. And there's no neo in this sector, by the look of it. What was in orbit again? Promethium and gold. Yeah. Huh. Okay. I can live without neo. That's not a big deal. Neo and magnesium. We got a bunch of neo. Everything else is in this sector, so that's kind of cool. If we need something, we can go search for it. Go down to the planet. So that's good. Uh, that means that this is a good, viable place to set up a base. So I'm going to level off and face the sun. So I like that. It's kind of ahead of us here. Um, and then... What we're going to do is we're going to make a base starter. Should we do that? Let's just do it straight from here. That's fine. Uh, we can put it into output because we've got space in the output. So base starter. And then we need a whole bunch of concrete. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the large constructor pumping out concrete going to output actually you know what i'm going to go into blocks i'm going to go to blocks so i'm going to dump it into blocks because we're going to connect to blocks i think because there's a bunch of gear in there already so yeah 
Uh, and then from here, it was one of these cargo boxes, yeah. And so now I can just pump out concrete by the oodles. So there we go, we'll cup. We'll start with a couple of stacks. It'll probably fill this up, but that's fine. Okay, so we can we can turn this off. The thrusters, that is. And what else? We can grab the stuff. So yeah, I didn't want it in output. We'll put it here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to connect to blocks. Because this is going to be our our repository. 96k. It can probably hold quite a bit. So, um, And then from here, we're going to connect to our Wi-Fi. So we've got some solar panels. We only got two, eh? Okay, so we need more solar panels. We need a couple of capacitors. So let's do that. We can get that going in the other one, in the advanced constructor. And we can actually make the other one advanced constructor too. We should do that. So what do I need? I need, I got enough there. I can connect to mats. I don't have enough cobalt alloy. So let's make another cobalt alloy. Oh wait, that was supposed to go into mats. Not output. Let's switch that. Pop that into there really quick. Uh, we do have some full blocks, actually. You know what? Let's put those into blocks. Sorry, I'm all unorganized here. There it is. So we looted some more stuff from drones. Uh, that gives us like a whole bunch of plasma cannons, which is fantastic because you can only put four on a on a SV. That means we could like deconstruct the uh, the other one or throw it into a uh, a blueprint, but I'm not sure if I'm going to blueprint anything anymore. I think for this series, I might just be building it from scratch, or I probably will be building it from scratch. So now we need more stuff. Um, what else did we need to update? We need the we need a couple of computers and then energy matrix. So I think we've got what we need now to upgrade. So let's jump out and turn our jetpack on. Okay, because we don't have gravity. And then, so if we connect to mats, yeah, here, let's just put this down for a second. If we connect to mats, because it has what we need in it, and then we should be able to upgrade. So if we hit upgrade, yay, we now have two advanced constructors. Okay. Uh, that'll speed things up a bit. They'll consume a little bit more fuel, but whatever. They'll be substantially faster. Okay, so now let's reconnect to blocks. We're starting to get a good amount of concrete happening, and then we can actually do the base starter here. Might as well do some concrete already. And so that's working on concrete. This one's not doing anything. We need a bunch of solar panels, which we haven't actually learned yet. Okay. And capacitor. Solar. Let's make at least two of those. And then we'll learn base. Yeah, we've got a lot of stuff to learn. We do have a lot of points right now, 300. So I want to learn the large generator furnace. Deconstructor, uh, ATM, the solar panels. Don't really need the guns right now. We will need them. So let's just start off by taking them up to there. That's good enough. Uh, repair console, repair bay, 
Parape T2. Ramps, I kind of want those too. Polarized, I don't really need it. T3 fuel tank. Boarding ramps, that's good for CB2, right? Yep, okay. And then maybe we'll just hold off spending anymore at this point pretty much unlocked almost everything on the base so that I want anyway at this point so let's now make 13 more of the panels so 10 1 2 3 and we want that into blocks Okay, so it's making our solar panels, it made our capacitors, so that'll power us up. Uh, do we have any? We've got one light. We do have one fuel tank left, that's good. And a bunch of T2s, okay. Um, oxygen tanks already, good. We've got hangar door already, wow, okay. So we've got a bunch of stuff we can set up right away got some more container extensions good fuel tanks oxygen tanks well let's make uh, what are we gonna need we're gonna need some windows I guess I don't have a lot of silicone that's what I don't have a lot of you know what we're not gonna go for the windows <laughs> We're just going to make a small hangar pad type dealy construction, a uh, small little, a small base, basically, a, to, to store stuff and process ore and help build, uh, work on vehicles, I guess. It'll be a, a workshop with a small garden. Okay. So there we go. We got our panels. Let's grab these. So we've got some more blocks. Let's add to that. We'll grab our panels and we've got our. Oh, where did I have that going into? Right here. So let's grab those. Okay, that'll power us up. Come on, let me out. <laughs> Thank you. Head towards the sun. We're going to level off. Okay. Towards the sun. Level off. Towards the sun. <clears throat> and level off. Let's get the base done. We'll stick it right there. That's fine. Okay. There we go. We got the start of our base. We'll have to move this, obviously, but that's fine. Let's get some... Get some blocks up. So I think what I want to do is I'll probably back up. Yeah. I think what I want to do, because there's 15 of them, I want to stand them up. And I'm going to use the horizontal. These are airtight true. And those are airtight true. And those are airtight true, those slope ones. So what's the difference? So those have um, they sit nice and flush and have no bracketry by the look of it. What's what's this the difference? Oh, these sit higher, right? See that? Oh, these come halfway down. See that? Ah, that's what it is. 
these are the diff the the um, not so steep a slope. Okay, so let's do these ones. We'll pivot this around because it is facing up. I think this will be the ideal. We'll start in the center here. One there. So what I want to do is I want to do a bit of a slope here. Get this to... No. Okay, we probably got to do the... We'll probably have to do something like this. This one to sit flat. No? Oh, I gotta move a back one. I gotta pull back one because of the center. You can see where the pin, see the green pin? It needs it needs somewhere to actually oh, I can kinda get it there. Is that gonna work there? Is that where I want it? Yep. Okay. Or what no, it wasn't. Okay, well, let's pop that off. <laughs> Retrieve. So, where did I... Where did I... Oh, because I put this block on the wrong frickin'... Because I'm a doorknob. Let's try this again. Let's go on that block. And then if we pull this out one, it'll be much easier to place. That's it right there. There we go. Okay. And then like that. Like that. blocks does that make that? That's one, two, three, four. Each one of these are too high. Okay. <clears throat> So we'll do the upstairs. The upstairs will be the garden. Okay, so I'm gonna do three layers of five. So we've got three, we'll put one more each side. Come on. Oh, had it there. Right there. And, come on, you can do it. Right there. There. Come on. Oh, had it. Oh, come on. Right there. So that's a third, two thirds of them done. Now I'm going to do one more. So we want. What do we want? We want to bring this up. Right here and out. Is that gonna hit? No. Okay. We're just <laughs> we're just under it. Okay, that's fine. And then we want that right there. Boom. The only reason I put those cement blocks there is just so I could place these panels. Once we get the panels placed, I can remove the blocks. It just 
can see how temperamental they are at a place. Come on, right there. Nice. Two more. Had it there. Right there. And the last one should be. You picked it up. There it is. And that was the. That was that one. And right there. There we go. Okay, so we've got all our solar panels up. Um, and that is also a sealed wall. So I think what we want to do is we want to build out from here. All right, we'll just, we'll just build out from the bottom and then we'll figure it out. Yeah. garden will be up top somehow so this I think from here we can go like this start bringing blocks across I'm going to have to move this guy. While well, we're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, so basically what I'm going to do is this will be a a construction room storage blah 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 down on the bottom and then a small garden up on the top um, with the pad extending out a decent way I guess although we don't really need it to extend out too far just just enough to to repair vehicles with Okay, so, oh, let me just see how this is doing. I'm just going to cut here for a second, and I'll be right back. Okay, so, basically, what I'm going to do now is, give me my, thank you, <laughs> um, I'm just going to fill this in off camera. I'm going to basically connect up this to this wall here and bring this down. And then we're going to make an area up top here. Um, we might have to extend this out more. We might have to extend this out a little bit more. And then... Well, maybe not. We only need... Uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I, I probably will have to extend it out. Um, and then I'll seal that off. And then next episode we'll get probably the constructors and all that set up. And start processing ore, I think. Because I'm going to get I'm going to get a bulk of this built off camera. You guys don't need to see me watch put it in a whole bunch of concrete blocks. Uh, that's basically all I'm going to be doing right now. So, And i got to wait for them to cook up anyway. So next episode, we will continue working on the base. Until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.